Look at this. Look at this fucking moron. People have no idea how to drive. Don't you know that I have an emergency service call to go on? Ah! All right. So it is Saturday night, February 26th, 2022. It's 7 p.m. And I know Daniel went on a emergency service call today. It was technically a recall, but I'm still going to pay him for it. You know, it's not his, it's not his, not his fault that the furnace that he replaced the integrated control board on is in sensing flame. But nonetheless, he went out there, probably two hours of his time, maybe two and a half hours of his time. But the Mikey Pipes will take care of him. It is what it is. We love Daniel's son. Young kid, he's learning. He's learning every day. But I'm going to this service call right now in Valley Stream to Williamson Gas Fired Boiler. The lady's got a couple kids in the house, three. And she goes, listen, if you can't fix my eat tonight, I got to go to a hotel. I was like, nah, that's not happening. Don't worry. Don't worry. I know I have a Williamson control board in the truck. I got the temperature probe, which also acts as a low water cutoff. I have gas valve, I got I got all parts to make it up and running. Damper, you name it, I got it. It's all good. Don't you fucking worry. I will deliver heat. <laughs> uh, so some of you may be asking, do you actually like running these emergency service calls? Well, listen, I actually really, really enjoy what I do. It's a lot of fun and I really enjoy fixing things and making people happy while also making a boatload of cash at the same time. Facts, you know, emergency service call, you know, if someone's got, if technicians got to leave their house, they're, pre they're paying a premium. Make no mistake about it. They're paying a premium for someone, a technician to leave their house and come to you to fix your shit. That's as uncensored as it's going to get. So, it's going to cost. The parts are in the truck. It's like I got Johnstone in the back of my truck. Fucking Johnstone in the back of my truck. And let me tell you something. Effing Biden. The prices are only going up. Control boards. Almost doubled in price. So when I take a control board over my truck now... I really need to check my replacement cost before I sell that price, before I sell that part. Like on Christmas, or was it New Year's, Burnham Alpine. I go to this job, it needs a new Sage 2 controller. And it's like, you know, it's a couple hundred dollar part. Well, it was, <laughs> at least until that numb nuts Biden came into office and fucked us all in the ass. Jesus fucking Christ. Ugh, and I apologize for all those God-fearing people. And, you know, sorry, I don't mean to say Jesus effing Christ, but you know what I'm trying to say. We are so screwed. We are so screwed. And we got Sleepy Joe in office. Let me tell you something. If Trump was not in power right now, Putin wouldn't have the fucking balls to go into invade a sovereign nation like Ukraine. And let me tell you something. Props to those Ukrainians. They got fucking balls of steel. I hear that people can go to the, to the police station right now in, in uh, Ukraine and they're handing out AKs. Here you go. Here's weapons. Go, go kill these motherfucking Russians. I don't know what Putin's motive here is doing this, but not good, man. You don't invade a country like that, you know, without cause. Not right. Not right. All right, guys, I'm around the corner from the job. Try to take some footage on the Mikey Pipes channel. You know, not the uncensored one. <laughs> but stick around while I'm away in the for this next week. I'm leaving tomorrow morning. I'm flying out to the out west, going to the Rockies, go skiing with the boys. We do that once a year. And last year I didn't go. But it's gonna be fun. Alright, let's get going. Hope someone's home. Because I'm here. One thing I hate is when the testo is dead. Urgh.
Damn Williamson. The Testo was dead. Luckily, there's an outlet right there. Change the gas valve. Thermocouple. Combustion test. Sticker. Fucking morons. Fucking morons. Put the union all the way over there. I had to walk a little wedding spray down that valve. Hold on. All right, guys, it is 8.15. I am on my way home. Thank you so much for tuning in and listening to me rant. Uncensored. Goddamn Joe Biden. Wake the fuck up. Oh, I cannot wait until November 2022. Just a few short months away, there is going to be a most epic and beautiful red wave across America. People are fed up. And you know what's funny is that all these Democrats are now, they're flipping on Joe. They're, they're, they're flipping on him. They're like, no, we don't want nothing to do with him. He's a fucking moron. God help us and God bless America. All right, guys. Be well. God bless. Stay safe.